Um, Ezreal's a very annoying AD carry to play against. Uh, up. Like, normally if I was playing against Lux, I would consider maxing W second because she's going to push really hard and I want to be able to one shot the backline minions. Plus, she doesn't have a natural escape. The only thing she has is her shield, so I could max W. Um, but because Ezreal needs to be stunned long enough for my W hit before he can arcane shift away, I'm going to be max D second. Um, it's also, like, when you have somebody who's got a shield on the enemy team, it's good to max E second anyways, because if, like, your, uh, your W damage, if you put a second point into it, it actually only adds a base of 50 damage. Like, even if you put, a, like, three points into it, that's only 150 damage. The shield is going to do more than that, so if you can stun them longer than the shield takes to come out, then it's actually more beneficial to have gotten uh, E. So for Oriana and Lux, max E second. Even though they don't have like a, a jump, but it's not. Um, but I'll still max Q first. Like norm if I was versing Yasuo, I would put three points in Q so that I can harass with Q in lane, and then max uh, then put three points in E so that I can actually land my combo. But I'm not gonna do that against Lux and just try and do well against your shields. I like sustain. Um. Boost start is actually not that bad against Lux. So that, like if you can dodge your skill shots, um, you win lane. So I you could start boots against Lux. Um, I just rather have the, the potions. E2, amigo, because I'm Brazil. Something that's really noticed that knows about low levels. Uh, lower low elos, excuse me. Um, <laughs> sorry, I'm laughing at my own jokes. I got a case of the self laughies. <laughs> um, something that's really noticeable about the low elos is how long they take to get off the fucking mountain. Org is still there, like, if this was an invade, we would, uh, we'd be in trouble. We'd be down a person. Or if we were trying to invade, we'd be down a person. Getting out off the bat, uh, getting out here early really helps. Like, I died last time because they got to here before I did. And I fucking base checked while well, not paying attention. That is very dirty. Alright. So, they might lane swap actually. They might do Rise against. Because technically, Rise is a counter to Vigar. I don't believe it actually is. Um, it's annoying for sure, but it's not a counter. Yes. This is why I don't leash, by the way. Lux missed that minion because she's off leash. Uh, leashing. Words are hard, okay? I missed the minion because I'm just bad at this game. So there's definitely certain matchups that you don't want to trade against. Lux isn't necessarily one of them, especially when her Q's on cooldown, I get, I get some free damage. Alright, hit level 2 first, and all that, that just gives me security, really. I'm not going to be making too big of plays. So she's pushing really hard, and I'm going to have to farm under tower. But that's just Lux being Lux. Oh, well, that wasn't the worst. The thing is, is what she's doing, she's gonna run out of mana pretty quickly, at least. Oh. Um. um so, the reason why I get two points in Q before maxing or putting a point in W is because the combo costs so much mana. Like, I, I, I can't be throwing out W's this low. Okay, got a flash. Alright, 830 on her flash. I'm gonna use one of my potions. 
write down her flash in chat so that I can. Alright, I'm gonna freeze it a little bit. I, I just didn't, well, it's not really frozen, but I didn't want those to hit the tower. Alright, she's pretty much Oom. Nice. I don't think you need to flash for that, but... Well done, nonetheless. Uh, good job on this Warwick, by the way. Last time I had, I had an Eve, and... We burned her flash right away, and she didn't come back in game for me at, at all. So, props to the Warwick for knowing what's up. Okay, well, I fucked that up. I'm just gonna push out a little bit. Now it's on the back. So, one thing I totally neglect to do often. So see that you don't last hit with Q often as possible. The only reason I'm not is because I don't have very much mana sustain low level, and I think it's more important to harass the enemy lane opponent to get them out of lane than it is to farm up your Q. I'm gonna have enough AP once I get two items to one shot basically anybody. So I'm not too worried about the extra 60 that I'm missing. That makes sense. I just don't want this to hit the tower. I'll take a little bit of extra damage for it. Sensor shit's on cooldown. Enjoy your damage, Lux. Fuck. Bitch! Hey, what's up, man? I forgot that you were in this game. You're about to have some bad times if you continue to do that. In fact, I think, I think you can enjoy some bad times right now. Thank you, come again. Time to back. <laughs> See? <laughs> I didn't beat Connor. <laughs> so one thing a lot of little people kind of do is they wait until they're full mana when coming off the tower. You have to realize that your mana regens as you're walking back. So me to sit like, I, look, I'm full. I didn't even. I could have waited, or I could have gone a tick earlier, even. Just little things like that kind of help you get to lane quicker. And honestly make you lose less C uh, CS. And it, start, it really starts to add up. And who knows, maybe that couple things of CS actually makes a difference. So if you're having, so remember that you need to get an auto attack in on these lovely uh, little minions. In order for the tower to hit. Um, and you still deal with the CS. Go ahead and ward up. Pantheon is probably 6 now. Alright, her spells aren't cooldown. And I'm not gonna be able to get her, but I'll zone off this experience for sure. And I will punish you for being against me. Oh, Warwick. Warwick. Buddy. You okay? Yeah, you okay. Again, her shit's on cooldown. Which means. Can't really. Ah, suck. Alright, so 
I still suck. So again, I'm gonna max E second because I want the sh That is scary. Alright, okay. Lux Flash, 14. 14. Remember to always add up your mana and make sure you can actually kill her. And not be a complete dickhead. I'm dumb, basically. That's kind of how that works. So this Lux is... Half my CS! I wish I had enough money for a war, but I don't have any more slots for it. She's not really hitting me with any skill shots. Alright, I'm gonna add my damage. Uh, that's 500, 850, uh, 1250. Even with her magic resist, I'm going to one shot her when I get my ult up again. So I'm gonna follow my lane opponent. I'm going a bit ham there, boy. Maybe she back off. Wow, good job. So when he died, I thought that we were about to be in a 4v3, which is why I said we should back off. But uh, the Varys is, I guess, a god. And I should have fallen. Hey, what's up, Fox? Hey. Do you remember this play? No. What? I had a minion. I'm playing really badly, like I should have killed her there, but I like I walked towards her rather than like I right clicked and walked out of range. But hey, man, hang on. That's why I put the ward that deep by the way. I think I could maybe 1v2 get here actually. Okay, so I need to watch my mana. I sure actually have enough to be able to this time. He's got tenacity, so I, that's something you should always watch for in Vygar. He's got tenacity, which means my stun's gonna last a lot shorter than it normally would. But it also, um, I've got three points in stun, so it should last long enough for my W to eat tenacity. And we're good. Yes, that's the tower. What's up, Kale? Oh, you bitch! Go ahead and pick up some, uh, I don't know. I'm not saying we made passionate 
love or anything, but Vigar totally fucked you in the end. Fucked. Well, that was nice. Oh, you whore! You steal one of my minions too? Here, you can have this ward. <laughs> so I am being very cocky right now, and I'm okay with it. What's up, Pantheon? Is that a blue buff for me? Oh, I think it is. Fucker! I'm bad at this game? See that Q now? Q? That means I'm bad at this game. And I didn't DFG. Huh. I must have been just out of range. Oh. Fuck. Lux. Yeah, so this Lux is gonna have a bad time if she can't, if I can kill her without having to use my ult. Stop, stop making fun of me, okay? I do something really cool in a second. Like, this is basically my first time Vygar, okay? This game's over. <laughs> the young Nicholas Cage. Dude, despite all his rage, he's still caught in Vygar's cage. Okay, so she's got... I can totally DFG alter. Uh, I'm not even gonna bother with the cage anymore. She gets close enough to me. <laughs> hey! Whatever, I got health bots. Alright. Take cockiness to, cockiness to the next level and solo push it. Tier 2 inhibitors, Vygar. Hey! Hey, Israel. You want to play a game? I believe in you, you can do it. I believe in you, Ez. Oh, you wreck discipline. The double tenacity coming out of the Pantheon. What up? Oh. oh, wait, no, that got changed, didn't it? Oh. I'm an idiot. <laughs> That's no longer double tenacity, huh? Okay. You're off the hook. You're off the hook, Pantheon. Later, nerd. Oh, wait. Those are not my minions. Why are those not my minions? Good job, bot lane. You're doing things. This might be one of them surrender at 20 games. 
Pantheon's like, I don't want to fuck with this guy again. Immediately flashes. That's hilarious. Rise has a lot of HP. So I have my ultimate against the rest of them. Alright, boots or death cap is the question. Death cap. Always death cap. That's not true, but fuck it. Maybe I can get my first blue of the game. What's up, Blitz? You rocked into the wrong part of town. Warwick, work, please. Warwick. Oh, you're God. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Lux is me. Hey. Do that again. I'm gonna fucking kill you. Warwick solo wind dragon. <laughs> Thank the left F. I'm surprised that they didn't. Okay, they're going off on a on a lovely chase. Holy shit! While we're getting the inhibitor. Oh my god, is she gonna live? What a fucking beast. Wow. What? Oh, it was just invisible. No, that's weird. Woo! <laughs> Fucking blitzcrack. 